Welcome to Willy's! Let's have some fun! Asks the sailor adrift at sea, the hiker long lost in the woods, or even the soul separated from the body. Any port in a storm is welcome. But what happens when the shelter proves deadlier than the storm? Hey, Susie Q! Pick up another one of those chairs, huh? Fire's getting low. I don't care what you two say. These guys are creepy as fuck. How can you sleep here? You kidding me? This bed is perfect! Me and Dusty have been here over a month! Whoever owned it just up and split years ago just cause the cops ran into place after a couple people died or something. If you don't like it, you could always find somewhere else to stay. Hey, I ain't complaining. Just... Feels like they're staring at me sometimes, this is all. <sighs> Damn it! Freaking wood. Cut my hand good. Ain't nothing here but a bunch of stuffed dummies. <laughs> ah! Carl, what the hell? Look, we're looking for no trouble. Whoever's out there, just, just leave us be! It was that thing! That thing attacked Carl! Here! The thing of boats! We, we don't want it. it! It's all yours! Don't mind if I do! Mother! Here, let me help you with that, pal! Yeah. That's better! You, stay away from me! Whatever the hell you are! Get away from me! That's no way to treat your amigos, Karino. Uh, come dance uh, with me! Uh, no. Stay back. They're not real. Not. See? <laughs> For every ending, whether it's happy or not, there comes a new beginning. In death, there's often new life. As the wise man says, when one door closes, there is another one surely about to open. Welcome, y'all. Thanks for coming down for this historical grand reopening of the best darn family restaurant this side of the old Mississippi. Willie's Wonderland. This has a bad idea written all over it, Sheriff Hobson. Don't you worry none, Deputy Lund. I'm keeping Tex on a short leash. Let the fun begin! The entire facility has been totally revamped and is now a state-of-the-art family entertainment facility, folks. I spared no expense. Look, Ma, a pinball machine. Can I play it? I want everyone to feel at home here at Willis. Among friends, my chief maintenance officer, Chad, has given Willie and all his buddies a complete checkup and has certified each one of them 110% fun. Ain't that right, Chad? You'll never forget a visit to Willie's. But what about all the murders? Yeah, a lot of people died here. That was like 10 years ago, people. Let's not focus on the past here. Any shadow Jerry Robert Willis cast over this place is ancient history. I'm giving you my Tex McAdoo personal guarantee this place is 100% safe. Oh, that pose! Perfect. Now just hold that pose, everyone. One more shot should do it. Say cheesecake. It sure was nice of you to come all the way out here on a Sunday for our annual portrait. Would you believe no one else was available? Not a problem, ma'am. 
I always make time for families, especially ones as lovely as yours. Do you promise to make our pictures look pretty, Mr. Willis? Don't you worry none, honey drop. I'm gonna take extra special care of y'all. Come on, everyone. I've got another surprise for y'all. Right through here. Mom, that gorilla just smiled at me. That's what he's supposed to do, dear. This is where the magic happens, people. The super happy fun room. Whether it's a birthday bash for that special little one, or just looking for a safe place for your kids to play. Constantly supervised by a certified, trained staff member. Hey, y'all. Um, go willies? D -d dad uh, hold on, Billy. My shoe is untied. I sweet Jesus! I almost forgot to show you all the new soda fountains. Come on, everyone. We've got a dozen different flavors. Let's go! Here's that glass of lemonade you asked for, Mr. Willis. Well, thank you, Honey Drop. I'll be with you in just a minute. <laughs> Oh, come on now, child. Don't make this any harder than it needs to be. Uh, stay away! I couldn't have taken a more perfect picture myself. Now hold still, child. And that was just a small taste of what we've got in store for you folks. Come back later tonight for the official big grand opening. And bring some friends. It's gonna be big, huge. Phew, that was too close. Where the hell is Jed? Either you two numb nuts seen Mr. Love around here? I think he's back in the super happy fun room, sir. Thanks. And put a little elbow grease behind that. We need this place to sparkle. There you are. I thought you said you had these things under control. This one almost shish kebab some guy. I saw it. What would we have done then? There must have been some kind of glitch is all. Don't worry about it, Tex. I've got this all under control. You better. Easy, big fella. You don't just need to be patient a little bit longer. This, this animal has already been convicted of killing three other families while posing as some kind of photographer just to get into their good graces. And this is what he did to them. All of them, <laughs> mother, father, son, and poor, poor little Annabelle. What do you have to say for yourself? What kind of monster does this to another human being, let alone a child? <laughs> It's not polite to point. Terry Robert Willis, you shall be placed in a mental institution for the criminally insane until such time as you can be legally tried for your crimes against humanity. We have got to get our A game going on here, people. I gave these folks a text McAdoo guarantee. Ain't no coming back from that. Why do you look like you're about to have an aneurysm, Mr. McAdoo? The folks earlier looked like they liked the place just fine. Fine? Fine won't cut it, sugar hips. I've soaked every last dollar I have into this place. Failure is not an option, people. <sighs> I knew I should have worked at the stop and plop instead. I'm going to scrub down the bathroom, Mr. McAloon. I mean, do. I'll help. Get to work, everyone. Bell, I need your help in the back room. Together, partner. This is all going to work. Just stick to the plan and you'll be rich. Rich like you always dreamed. You wanted to see me, Tex? I thought I could help you with some of that stress. Let me help you find your super happy fun place. Now that's more like it. Being the boss is supposed to have some perks. <laughs> What the hell? Stop! Well, why well, have never? What? There was... Who? What? If I'm not good enough for you, 
I'm sure I can find someone around here who will appreciate me. Bell, wait! I was talking to her, not you! Oh, hell. <laughs> Maybe the pressures are getting to me. Sometimes I wish I was just a dummy like you. You've got no idea what pressure even is. Now, where is Miss Debbie? She promised she would be here to help before the curtain goes up. I have to find her. It's almost time for the show, Miss Sarah. Has anyone seen Miss Debbie? No, ma'am. Debbie? Gary? How could you? My fiancé and my best friend? We can't explain. It's not what it looks like. Sarah, calm down. We can work this out. You know what, Gary? Maybe you're right. I can't wait. They've been practicing for months. Miss Sarah? This isn't what we practiced. <laughs> Sorry, girls. I had to change the routine. <laughs> That's awesome. Somebody The nerve of that man. I got half a mind to break up with him for good. <laughs> oh, I didn't see you there, sweetie. You shouldn't sneak up on a girl like that. Maybe I'd be better off with someone like you anyway. I wouldn't have to worry about them talking back none. <laughs> oh, hey, Tex, is that you? Okay. This isn't funny anymore. Who's doing this? Stop! Get away from me! Someone! Help! Oh, thank God! There's some fucking maniac back there who almost bit my arm off! Another one? Punch it! believe this walking turd killed all those people but we gotta take him for his mandated time to socialize even psychopaths have rights Evans here you are sunshine he's all yours doc you've been here almost three months mr. Willis isn't there something you'd like to share with me I'd like to help you <laughs> my word orderlies He's a real charmer, Andy Doc. Come on, Romeo. We've got some nice big bills with your name on them. Have it your way, Mr. Willis. We'll just have to increase your medications. There's no bleeding in the super happy fun room, Willis. Behave yourself. It's the pain, you know. That's what binds us all together. Without it, what will we have in common? You have it, the same as I do. I can see it in your soul, plain as a day. You and I are kindred spirits, my dear. We would be great friends outside of this place. You wouldn't want a friend like me, mister. I'm a monster. Oh, child. We're all monsters on the inside. Some of us are just better at hiding it, is all. It doesn't matter anyhow. They're never going to let either one of us out of this place. Oh, never say never, honey drop. Bell, you back here? I'm sorry. We're getting ready to open up, though. And I'm gonna need all hands on deck. Bell! Oh my god, what the hell happened here? I gotta. 
I, I gotta call the sheriff. I wouldn't do that if I was you, Tex. You'll lose everything. Is she really worth all that? Uh, she's dead. The blood. Here's a little secret I've been keeping from you, Tex. Willis, he ain't dead. He's here in Willie the Weasel's body. And so are all his friends. And if you don't do exactly what they want, you'll end up the same as poor Bill here. But, 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 but... <laughs> you okay, Mr. McAdoo? You don't look too good. We got a crowd outside waiting to get in. What do you want us to do? Let them in. God help us. Let them in. 